What's up guys, thanks for checking out the video today. We have my first ever PSA preview submission video. Uh, this is 11 total cards that I'll be sending off to PSA to get graded. Uh, as many of you might know, PSA just suspended all their services for grading until supposedly July 1st for anything less than $300 a card. However, I created this order about 10 days ago uh, and just have been slacking on sending it out. So I'm gonna do that ASAP and sneak these cards on over before uh, we no longer can. Um, so starting off, I'm gonna start from the back. They're in no particular order. Bunch of rookie quarterbacks in this one. We have an autograph coming up. Uh, mix of basketball, football, and baseball. So I'm pretty excited for this one. Uh, this one, I pulled it out of the Run Good Life box he made about two weeks ago now. Um, not a crazy expensive card, but just one that I absolutely love. Uh, it's John Morant's Luminance coming out of uh, Panini Chronicles with just the sickest action shot dunking over Kevin Love. So I just really want to get this slabbed. Uh, a 10 would be awesome. We can take a quick look. Corners all look pretty good. And then the back, I think, looks pretty solid. So we'll put that one off to the side now. Next, we have a base prism, Jordan Love. This one I pulled out of the boom box. My latest boom box, actually, that video is posted. Uh, looks pretty solid. The edges have a little frill. Um, and that bottom left corner might be a little white. So maybe a nine on this. Even with a nine, I'd be happy with that. Uh, next, we have uh, another boombox hit. This is the Joe Burrow Mosaic Base. This is a pretty clean card. I think, uh, well, that's on the outer case there. Looks pretty good to me. For all of these, I'm just hoping for a nine. A tens would be awesome, but you can't really expect tens. So awesome card there. Up next, we have the SP Justin Herbert Prism Rookie card. It's an absolute sick card. Might be a little corner ding there, not too sure. But again, just hoping for a nine. Even at a, a nine on this, I'd get my value back from the grading. Uh, up next, we have two of these, two of these Tua Base Prisms. Pretty clean. For these, I think I'm expecting probably an eight. There's some edge wear there, but I got uh, both of these in a lot deal for pretty cheap on eBay. So I feel it, it, it's worth 25 bucks to grade it each one. I think I'll, I, well, I'll, I'll keep one if I can get a 10, which is doubtful, but either way, I'll make my money back. As long as I get even an eight, I wouldn't be too upset. Uh, this, Rated rookie, Donruss rookie card of Josh Allen. I got this for a decent price on eBay probably two months ago. And I've just been slacking on sending it out to PSA, but now we absolutely have to since they suspended the services. So I'm pretty glad I was able to make this order before they dropped the news of that. Here we go. Next, uh, Joe Burrow base prism. I got this in a lot deal off eBay also. I got this and two other Burrow rookie cards for I think $70, which is a really good deal. I'm, yeah, I'm seeing a little edge wear on the left there and the bottom left corner might have a little bit of a ding. Um, hoping for an eight, a nine would be awesome. But I got them for a really good deal, so I'm not too worried about it. Uh, next, we have a pink refractor of Luis Robert, Topps Chrome. It's a sick card. This one I think has potential for a 10. But again, like I said, I'm just hoping for a nine. Actually, this is the one with a little bit of the corner ding. So this one I think is, I actually have another one. This one, hoping for a nine. I think the other one's a little bit cleaner. We'll see this next one here. Yeah, this is the cleaner looking one for sure. 
My girlfriend actually was able to pull two of these in back-to-back -back, uh, cello packs that we found at Target, luckily, before the craze. Um, so just ridiculous hits out of the cello. I think a PSA 10 of this goes for over $200, uh, at least the last time I checked, which was over a month ago. So that might have gone up or gone down. And we have our last card, which my girlfriend also pulled out of a Topps Chrome cello pack which she just has the best luck. So I'll have her in more videos um, for sure coming up. But this might be my favorite card. It's a Jordan Alvarez Topps Chrome Autograph. It's a sticker auto, but still really nice looking card. The back looks very clean. All the corners look good. I mean, it's very minor wear on the bottom left. That seems to be the corner that causes me the most trouble. Um, but it'd be hard for me to imagine less than a nine. So I'd be happy regardless with this one. And then just to, in addition, we got some recent pulls out of a Bowman's Best that we ripped off camera. We got two Jason Dominguez autos, one number to 99, and this really sick Jordan Alvarez cracked ice. I was gonna submit this to PSA, but now I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do since they're delayed. Just wanted to showcase that. That might be a, if I can sneak it into HGA or maybe even SGC, we'll see what I do with those, but I'll make sure to update it on these videos. Uh, so that does it for this preview submission to PSA. I uh, appreciate all you guys watching. If you enjoy the content, please like, and I'll have more videos coming every week. Thanks.